Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, the Duchess of Sussex, attended a sparkling Cirque du Soleil benefit performance last month in aid of Prince Harry's Centibail Foundation. Centibail is now known for the work it does to support children and young people affected by HIV in the African countries of Lesotho and Botswana. However, when Prince Harry set up the charity in 2006, he went against the wishes of his father Prince Charles, royal author Kate Nichol reveals. Her 2018 book Harry, Life, Laws, and Love delves into the younger days of the Duke of Sussex. Ms Nichol writes, it was a small victory for Harry, seeing that the Prince of Wales had been set against his sons establishing their own charities until, in William's case, he graduated, or in Harry's, he completed his military training. Harry assured his father he could do both. He went on to train as an armoured reconnaissance troop leader at Bivingdon Army Base in Dorset later that year. Prince Harry set up the charity after visiting Lesotho and meeting Prince CSO, who had also lost his mother, Queen Mahamato, at a young age. Ms Nichol reports how Harry said at the time Centibail means forget me not in Sisapho, and it's a way both me and Prince CSO can relate to our mothers, who were both working with orphan children. He added, rather than aiming directly at AIDS itself, Centibale is about the knock-on effect on the children. In addition to Centibale's success, the Duke of Sussex also founded the Invictus Games in 2014. Alongside Prince William and Kate Middleton, he also established the Royal Foundation of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and Prince Harry.